I posted a short montage of our cat last week, and he gained quite a bit of traction, so I thought I'd formally introduce you to Kiwi. He also goes by Bubba and Kiwi Biwi. We celebrate his birthday on January 1st, which means he's almost three now, which is crazy. And yesterday, I filmed a video about Kiwi's Catterday routine, but when I finished editing it, I was like, wow, this is the most boring video I've ever watched in my entire life. So Kiwi and I are going to take some quizzes today instead and hopefully get this video up by 11. This first quiz is called, how often does your cat meow? Oh, just kidding. <laughs> Can we guess what your cat looks like? I feel like just when he wants to play or when he's bored, so it doesn't really fit in any of these. I'm just going to say it's random. How much of a baby is your cat? He's the biggest baby. Is your cat the best cat in the world? I want to say yes, but there are too many good cats. Does your cat like to be held? He loves it. Does your cat hide a lot? Not really. He did hide when we first moved in, but that's just because he didn't know the place. But now we always know where he is. He's either on the couch, under the couch, under the table, or in a box. <laughs> you got orange. I consider Kiwi to be a tuxedo cat. I don't know if that's true, but he's definitely not orange. This next quiz is called, does your cat really love you? Your cat loves to cuddle up with you or near you for an afternoon nap. Always. Every morning you have a portion of love from your cat. Always. He literally wakes me up every single morning with cuddles and occasionally doesn't stop as soon as you feed him. Well, I'll say sometimes. Your go-to beauty tool has become lint rollers to remove layers of cat hair constantly covering your clothes. Um, I'll say sometimes because I don't really use the lint roller, but that's just because I'm lazy. <laughs> your cat thinks that your main responsibility at home is petting him or her. Always. I work from home now, so he likes to get a lot of attention. And that your lap is just a funny kind of chair. He prefers the couch, but he will sit in my lap while I'm working sometimes. Your cat showers you with presents. These presents can occasionally be dead and do not come with a receipt. Never. He doesn't really go outside. Your cat nuzzles your face when you cuddle. Always. <laughs> Your cat loves it when you scratch his or her tummy. Pretty much always. He's not super touchy about his tummy unless he's in attack mode, but I mean, that's obvious. In your cat's mind, you settling down to watch TV or read a book is an activity that should be prevented at all costs. I don't know what this means. Does it mean that he bothers you? I'd say never, he just, he's kind of chill. Attempting to do either of these activities means that you will get a mouthful of cat hair. Maybe sometimes when I'll reading, he'll come cuddle on my chest. <laughs> so uh, we'll say sometimes. Your cat gives you mini arm and leg massages from time to time. He's not much of a kneader, which I'm sad about because I think cat kneading is so cute. Your cat rubs against your leg whenever you enter a room. Um, he doesn't really rub against our legs, but he bites them. <laughs> so uh, I'll say never. Your cat never leaves their turds on top of the litter. Always. <laughs> when you return home, you get worried if your cat doesn't stink up. Slink up. Oh. <laughs> when you return home, you get worried if your cat doesn't slink up to you within 30 seconds of opening the door. Always. If he's not coming to see me, then I feel really sad. We're a match made in cat heaven. You and your cat have a one-of-a-kind bond that makes other humans jealous. Your cat feels safe around you and rewards you with lots of kitty love and attention. Is that true, Kiwi? We're a match made in heaven. Okay, this one I thought was very interesting. It's by How Stuff Works. Okay, it's a user submitted one, I guess. Can we guess your pet's name in just 30 questions? Does you pet like to eat grass? Um, my pet doesn't like to leave the house. <laughs> How does your pet feel about thunderstorms? I think I'm more scared of thunderstorms than he is, but we do cuddle. <laughs> How did you get your pet? Um, well, technically he's Quentin's, so I'm going to say a friend gave it to me. <laughs> what does your pet do while you're at work? Um, he just sleeps. <laughs> all day. What would you dress up your pet as for Halloween? I think you would make a really cute pumpkin. Which animal is your pet's spirit animal? Oh, definitely a tiger. Like low-hanging fruit for the cat answer. How would you describe your pet's fur? I would say it's sleek. Do you hold birthday parties for your pet? That's a great idea. I would, but uh, I don't have any friends and neither does he. What human job could your pet handle? Sleep study participant? What pet can handle any of these other jobs? How many pets do you have? Just one. What do you think your pet thinks of when you are drunk? I don't really drink, so uh, probably, what an idiot. How does your pet wake you up? Um, he does lick my face, so he usually just wakes me up by jumping on the bed and cuddling with me, but sometimes he does lick me, so I'll put that he licks me. Do you have a pet door in your home? I live in an apartment. What's your pet's favorite toy? He actually has three favorite toys. This string that fell out of a hoodie, this string that fell out of a hoodie, and this spring with a piece of plastic attached to it. Also, now you're awake. 
So is garbage an option? I guess I'll just put um, a stuffed animal because we do have these little McDonald's toys that he plays with sometimes. Do you ever cook for your pet? Uh, I do not, <laughs> but I don't even really cook for myself. So what outdoor activity does your pet like most? Um, he would probably love chasing things. How does your pet feel about the vet? I think he freaks out. Does your pet sleep with you? He does in the morning, but I don't think during the night. So I'll just say sometimes. How old is your pet? He is a few years old. He's almost three. Should I reposition? What's your pet's favorite feature? His fur, his ears, his nose, and his tail. Um, I'll probably say his tail. Which famous pet do you like the most? Oh, Stitch, definitely. What might you give your pet for a treat? Tuna, but that's also his meal, so. Does your pet love people? My pet loves them after he gets to know them. I think at first he gets really scared, but, but then it's okay. Is that Kimi? How's your pet with children? My pet hasn't met many kids. <laughs> Any kids. Is your pet food motivated? He just eats whenever he wants. And he's more motivated by affection, I think, so I don't know what to answer for this. I'll just leave it. Where would you take your pet on a date? Oh, he would love the aquarium. He would go crazy. How would you describe your pet's current mood? Maybe loving. <laughs> We're just hanging out. Does your pet like other animals? Um, he's kind of a loner. <laughs> what do you think your pet dreams about? Good question. Oh. Maybe... Probably... Freedom. Ow. Does your pet like car rides? Um, I think he hates it. <laughs> Apparently he was crying the whole time driving to Paris. Your answer is Cat Von Sleep. The sweet and funny way you've told us about your pet makes us think that you have named them Cat Von Sleep. No matter which variety of pet you may have, your pet loves to sleep the day away. Your laid back companion provides you with endless amounts of love and giggles. You wouldn't have it any other way. Um, his name is Kiwi, but... <laughs> Sure. And the final quiz that we'll be taking tonight is describe your pet and we'll determine their personality type. Describe your pet in one word. Um, warm. <laughs> the color of your pet's aura is definitely... I associate him with red, for sure. If your pet had a sandwich named after him, what would it be? Um, meatball sub maybe, because he can get pretty messy. <laughs> is your pet into cuddling? Always. Your pet is picking your next vacation destination. Where are you headed? I don't know, where do you want to go? Just based off these pictures, probably Kyoto. How does your pet feel about the outdoors? He likes looking at it, but he hasn't been outside. Pick another animal with similar energy to your pet. Maybe a chameleon? And apparently he's an extrovert. He has total Leo energy. I don't think that's very accurate. So uh, none of these quizzes... Oh, except he does love me, and I will accept that as an answer. But other than that, none of them were really on the nose. Anyway, thanks for watching, and uh, thanks for all the love. Not all my videos are Kiwi related, but he does make cameos, since he's just so curious and is always always wondering what I'm up to. I think I'm going to be uploading Kiwi montages a lot more from now on, so if that's what you subscribed for, then don't worry, they'll keep coming. And Kiwi doesn't even know he went viral over the weekend, but he thanks you all very much. And if you happen to miss that video, I'll link it in the description, as well as his Instagram, which is KiwiQM, which is run by both me and Quentin, but mostly me. DM him pics of your pet. Wanna say bye, Kiwi? <laughs>